first start off by saying oh we God. thought we were actually gonna be cute <laughs> in this video if <laughs> we don't look that good then i'm sorry like hey guys welcome back to my channel um today we have a different type of video for you as far as our masks we have some uh it burns and it's getting tight we have these masks that we bought from um target you know what? when we rinse it off our face is probably gonna be like really tight and bright and yeah you know so <laughs> how about we talk about <laughs> nobody's gonna be able to even listen to what i'm talking about because they're gonna be cracking up <laughs> today's motivation okay so clearly we have on these face masks and we're not the cutest right now with these masks on but the lesson of the day is beauty is only skin deep okay mm -hmm. because it doesn't matter how <laughs> your outside looks clearly but it is what is on the inside <laughs> that really matters because we can be as ugly as could be right now with these masks going but be the most beautiful souls on the inside yeah that's true <laughs> so basically what we say is if God took everybody's outer or everyone's bodies away and it was just spirits that was walking around would you still be considered pretty or would you be ugly because your appearance or how you have your hair or how you or what outfit you wear does not it ultimately does not matter it's about it what puts in here you it know? doesn't. It doesn't. So I think what we're trying to say <laughs> because ultimately God doesn't see. I mean, of course He sees us, but He doesn't care if you have on red bottoms. He doesn't care if you have on felines. He doesn't care if you have on Gucci shirt, Gucci shoes, a Gucci bag. He doesn't care. Ultimately, He wants to know what is your heart pure and what is in your heart, as Monty said. So this is Are you trying that. to be cute? No. Yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is what I want to say. So y'all know. Is, that, that is why our hair is wrapped up. Our face is covered. Our bodies are covered. Because the message, again, is beauty is only skin deep. Okay? And it's really about what's in here versus what's out here. But another thing that I wanted to say is that, like, everybody pretty much knows me and my channel for being positive and inspirational or whatever. And so I have been doing, like, funny videos lately. But I wanted to do something, like, more serious and more positive and more inspirational and more, like, Oh my pushing gosh, people to be, to be better and be better <laughs> you know we look, we look like moms <laughs> like it's like you always <laughs> open up to your eyes so it's like i always want to make sure that i inspire the people that come to my channel for the the inspiration or the extra push or like it's yeah nervous. because even though i am young i do know what i'm talking about i do watch that's a lot of youtube why? Because we don't know everything that we're talking about. No, like I'm saying as far as like positivity and stuff. Like I can be positive. Ultimately what you what what we what my prayer is is that God gives me wisdom so that I can inspire and encourage and empower anyone. If you are at a place in your life when you feel like you want to be over here but you're right here, okay, this is the beginning point and this is kind of like the ending point. And you feel like you, well, you know you want to be here, but you're kind of like right here. The best advice that I can give you is to just keep on pushing, hunty, or gentle, or <laughs> what am I saying for the voice? Just keep on pushing whoever you are that's watching this because I know that for me, like, I look at. I look at people who are where I want to be at in the future and I'm I, I'm only looking at their end result and not like where they started at or like what they went through to get where they are today but it's like you're only seeing their end result you're only seeing what they got from you know going through everything they had to go through so if you're watching this and you know you are out here you know working on your business working out in the gym working on your youtube working on your modeling career working on your whatever and you're only like 
still in the beginning stages just know that it's all a part of the process and it takes some time to get where you want to go it's not a get rich quick scheme you know what i'm saying i know we're kind of just like rambling right now <laughs> can't take myself serious so we just gonna keep on going we hope that this video makes sense and we hope that it inspires someone to get out there and not care about what anybody say because clearly we don't care about what anybody <laughs> says getting on camera looking like this when you get to a point in your life where you do not have to impress anybody then that's when you'll really start living your life and right now honey i feel accomplished because i feel like i look like i don't know what i look like but i'm still gonna post this video i'm still gonna advertise on my youtube channel <laughs> listen to all right i'm gonna just tell y'all what i do when i feel down when i feel depressed when i feel like things just just not going how I want them to go in my life. I listen to Les Brown, Eric Thomas, Eric Thomas. His name is oh E.T. Gosh, or whatever. I can't even feel my face. I listen I to. You just want to wash these off now. They're getting hard. We're gonna wash our faces off soon. But I listen to <laughs> I listen to T.D. Jakes. Ultimately, what I'm trying to say is like I listen to people that get me out of the funk. If you're going through something, you're said, do not like stay like right there. Like get yes. up, get up and get yes. out. Get and up. Don't fall into a pity party okay? no don't do it i have to say that i believe that we have to uh, trust the process okay don't for an example like if you feel like you're just losing everyone and you just feel like i don't have no friends or it's just me i don't have nobody to lean on you have to understand that maybe god is trying to isolate you so that he can get to you without any a outside God, or whoever you believe noise in. around you. That's, you what we're saying is don't stay in your funk right pray and like I, try to like let me no. Let me let me okay. say something about this because I'm a very sensitive person. Everybody me too. everybody knows me as sensitive. When I get in those like phases of my life like I I really do be wanting to like just go to sleep or just be in the dark or just like be to myself or just like you know go somewhere and cry but what is that gonna do for you people really don't care about you know your feelings like no one really cares if you're sad like people may say or tell you like yeah I'm here for you you need to talk X Y and Z but they really don't care like it's not you have to make a decision for yourself that you are gonna get up you're going to get out, you're going to get dressed, and you are going to live your life like it's the last day of your life.